Hi guys, um, I was going to do a video about um, the comments I received um, and I changed my mind. I'm going to make it a video about failure and I hope somebody gets something from this video. I was going to do, um, you know, give you guys a laugh with the comments I get, but I, I, I changed my mind. I thought, no, 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 I'm going to do it about failure um, because some of the comments, um, I picked up the energy that some of the people are scared to fail. So they attack people who they presume are successful so i'm going to tell you guys i'm a failure um and there's nothing wrong with it being a failure um i think it's best to say our perception of the word is wrong i think it's fair to say that um i think we if we don't fail, we don't succeed. It's that simple. Very few people succeed and become a success on their first attempt. And um, I guess that's why we have multiple paths in life as well. So I want to help you to look at the word failure, hangman moment, <laughs> from a different perspective. Um, if we chose to use the word practice instead of fail, we might have a better relationship with the word, right? Um, because we know in sporting events or things like that, we go, we're going to go practice. So we're going to practice for everything, right? We're going to practice for our exams and we're going to practice our driving and things like that. So <clears throat> do you see where I'm going? That even by changing that word that we have a negative attachment to, um, puts it in a whole new ball field, right? A whole new game that we're playing here. We no longer view it as a negative, right? I think it was Will Smith who you know, shared a video saying, fail quicker, fail often, fail forward, right? But I wanted to take it a step further and say, like, like I just said, like the word practice, if we exchange words on this journey, we can really turn it around. We can, that can be a game changer, changing the words that's why the hanged man always comes up in the readings look at it differently and you're going to have a different outcome it's it really is that simple i swear to you it really is that simple so if you think okay i failed uh um you know whatever it was you were trying to get your business off the ground say i failed at a relationship or you know if we extract the lessons from where we failed, um, we can fail forward. We can take that lesson with us, know that that doesn't work and move forward. The quicker we fail, the quicker we become successful, the quicker we move forward to success. Or each individual person has a different understanding of success, right? Some people may feel like I'm only successful if I'm a millionaire. Some people might feel like I'm successful if I got my thoughts out there. If I, if I helped one person, I'm a success, right? Um, so success is individual to you. So know what you want to be successful in. Know what um, you would class as successful and start failing right start practicing um remember every time we fail take the lesson take the lesson 
you're not failing. You're practicing for the main event, right? You're practicing for that moment where you're going to be successful. So if we look at it like we go to the gym or start running and things, we go to the gym until our muscles fail or we run a mile uh, until our legs fail. And then our body, it readjusts. The next time we can go that little bit further, right? Because our body's like, okay, I took the lesson. I got stronger. When we're bodybuilding or something, I'm not a professional bodybuilder. Um, dated one. Um, but what it is, is when we're working out, we're tearing the muscles, right? Till they break, right? And then they reform stronger and bigger. And that's what's going on with you guys. Every time you feel like you failed or broke, you reform stronger with the lesson and can move forward to the next step. So I guess I just wanted to say, um, if you spend your time trying to drag other people right or drag them down or drag their name um because if you wasn't doing that it mean it mean you spending time working on your own goals maybe you feeling then i guess um that you're being held back by fear and if you're scared do it scared just do it because the only thing that will happen is you'll learn and you'll grow and form stronger and you're one step closer to being successful. I, I guess that's all I wanted to share with you guys. You know, um, let's change the word failure um, to practice. I, I really believe that the words we use are very important. Our word is our wand, it's our creator. We're bringing things into being, we speak them into being. So please, um, change the words that we use. Kindness costs nothing, right? So if you have nothing good to say, say nothing. I don't know when that stopped being in fashion right if you don't have nothing good to say say nothing i thought everybody knew that um but i think it's just because if you see people i i feel like you're the ones who are meant to be here on my channel more than the other people so i'm telling you now i'm not taking offense to your comments you might catch me on a bad day and i'll sting you back i'm a scorpio um but i feel like you're meant to be here the most right? You found your way here for a reason. Take the opportunity to be supported, to get your ideas out there, to not feel out of place, to be able to share your opinion without being attacked. Stop attacking others for sharing their opinion. I mean, it says more about you than it does them. So if you think you're disguising or hiding behind like negative words or trying to drag people down, it's, it's, you're not hiding. You're exposing yourself even more. And I'm telling you, come on over to the light. Come on over to the light side. Join us people who are failing, who are attempting, who are trying at life. And maybe if you're not dragging other people and blaming other people, you can be accountable for your own actions and your own words and yourself and what's happening in your life. Because that's all I try to do here. I try to make you um, grab a hold of the reins, maybe even be inspired to start your own project or work for yourself or I, that's all I'm trying to put out there. So, yeah, just swap that word failure for practice. And I feel like you'll have a much better relationship with it and a much better relationship with yourself, the general public, because the general public have done nothing to you. We've just become accustomed to 
um, sitting behind a computer, being a computer warrior. I think Mike Tyson said it. Um, we've become accustomed to being nasty to people and not getting slapped in the face for it because we're behind a computer, right? Because every action has a reaction. So if you find people who are arguing back with you, you're just trying to drag them down. They can't be bothered with you. They, they will support you, however, if you are trying to accomplish your goals. Because there's a beautiful community here on this channel. It's really supportive. So, um, yeah, stop looking for company in that misery. Come out of it and be accountable for your actions. Be accountable for your life. I'm not saying, you know, it's so easy. But I'm saying once you start practicing, the only thing that's going to happen is you're going to get better. You're going to get to that place that you call success better, quicker. I've, I've been there. I've been, I can argue. I would choose to argue any side of an argument because I was just in tune. Um, I'm very like I've educated myself sort of thing on a lot of things and I can argue both sides of an argument so if I just felt like it I used to do the same and it was just stopping me and me not looking at my own life and my own situation I'd be I, I, I would literally um well I wouldn't literally go looking for it but let's say I would do it on my own personal Facebook with people, if I just felt that sort of way, or that if I was having one of those days or I was that way out, I could argue, even if I didn't agree with a point, I could argue a point. So I get what you're doing and it's, it's easy to see. And I feel like, you know, people will support you on this channel. If, if you're feeling down, if, if you feel anything, if you feel inspired, they'll tell you, go ahead, go for it, do it. But they they generally won't participate in your rubbish that you're putting out there. So it'll just make you eventually feel more alone. So fail often, fail quick, fail forward. And you're on your way to success. The most successful people have probably failed the most in life so i hope somebody got something out of this like i said i was gonna do about the comments um just read you some funny comments but it turned into this what can i say it's just how i free think <laughs> good luck guys